Okay, time for another story. Yay! This one is um, a bee story. Where are you going, sweetie? Oh, where are you going? Okay. This one is a bee story. It's, um, or wasps. I don't know what they were. I was living in Malaysia. Hornets, maybe. Uh, they were big, black-ish uh, hornets. Anyway, I was living in Malaysia. And um, I think this was in... I don't remember where this was. Maybe Kuching. Anyway, um, lived in this flat apartment, um, and in our backyard, we had a backyard, uh, there was a mango tree, a very large mango tree. And the way you determine which mangoes are ready to eat, which ones are ripe, is you shake the tree, and whichever mangoes fall, those are the ones you can then eat. So I had recently moved there. Uh, this was the first time that uh, I had gone out to get mangoes. So uh, I'm not dressed in missionary clothes or anything. I'm just in shorts and a t-shirt. Uh, it was our preparation day. So I go out there, I shake the tree um, as hard as I can. And as soon as I do, I'm enveloped in this buzzing black cloud of wasps or bees or something. <laughs> or hornets. Massive things. Um, and they are flying in my shirt, inside my oh, shorts, I mean, up through my middle area. Um, and so I am just slapping myself, <laughs> hitting myself all over the place, especially down below, <clears throat> um, to get the bees or whatever they were um, dead or off of me somehow. Um, and I'm running while I'm shaking my head, while I'm slapping myself, <laughs> while I'm screaming like a madman. And uh, back then we didn't have smartphones that had cameras, and so my companion wasn't taking video, which would have been awful, good, <clears throat> funny. Um, anyway, so finally <clears throat> I, I get out of the swarm of, of um, bees, Whatever they are. and I run into our house, I slam the door, and some of them come in there with me, and I'm slapping them, and now my companion's slapping me too, and hitting me, and kicking me, and uh, trying to get all the bees off of me. And... Uh, oh. Finally, oh, it felt like forever, but uh, finally, I got them all off, and they were all dead. All oh, the ones that were inside the house were all dead. And um, I go lay down, because I'm in such excruciating pain, and, and bee stings do, do a thing to the blood, I think. Anyway, I'm dizzy, and, and so we ended up counting. I had, I think it was 21 or 23 um, stings, and... Ooh all over my body. I had a couple down near the bum area. Um, it hurt really, really bad. So later when I was feeling brave enough, I and when I could walk, because it was kind of hard to walk with all the stings I had in the inner thigh area, um, I went out back to look at the size of the wasp's nest that I had disturbed. It was enormous. It was uh, bigger than a beach ball. I mean, it was, here we go, uh, about that big. Whoa! Yep. It was so big. Anyway, so thousands and thousands uh, had attacked me. It's a miracle I didn't die. Good thing I wasn't allergic. Anyway, that was a very uh, painful, unfun, unforgettable oh, experience. There was another one we just knew. Oh, I stepped on a bee once, twice, three times. <laughs> 